chess was a proving ground for the idea that machines could be smarter or better than humans. Of course, that wasn't really true. Uh, Deep Blue wasn't smarter than Garry Kasparov. But now, we're developing computers that can think, right? Process information the way that the human brain does. What do you think about the growing role that computers like that play in our lives? Well, I, I grew up with, um, um, with chess uh, databases, at least. That was, uh, that was not really the same thing, but uh, the easier access to information was a huge thing for me mm -hmm. uh, as, an improving, uh, as an improving chess player. I mean, it just made it so much easier to, uh, you know, to take your first uh, steps as as a chess player, uh, I have to say I don't particularly like um, the fact that we're so reliant on computers in in, in chess um, for preparation and everything. I I still think that the battle between the minds is is the interesting is the interesting part. That's that's what I what I love about chess. Um, is is artificial intelligence? Uh, helping to level the playing field in chess? Yeah, absolutely. Um, it's um, you know it ma it makes it uh, it makes it easier just uh, again uh, because it's easier to amass information mm -hmm. and also to it. I mean, in chess there's theory. I mean, you can prepare you can prepare openings. Um, uh, 20 moves in, into the game that lead you, that give you uh, a good chance. I mean, even much weaker players, a good chance to, to fight against me. So it's, it's definitely leveling the playing, playing field. And um, obviously, that's, that's not good for me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 